I had to redo this because it accidentally had and a sound covering it because I'm mass and I forgot that. But um, I like this sort of episode because this series because yes, it has anime has to be anime type of moments. But I'm just gonna the most important thing that I like is you have one episode sort of uh, bringing in having an episode about one person. And then they might appear in one bit of a ba scenery background and another. And they become slowly part of the bigger story. Obviously, they w they're like, oh, the friend and this and that. And it's like, they're going to be in it. But I like each, a couple of people have one episode. You still have the main focus on the protagonist. But you have like one episode that deals with this sort of like... Like, in the middle, there's one at the beginning, but he doesn't do much. And I'm not going to say which episode it is. But later on, there's an episode that shows his strength alongside the protagonist. Alongside a couple of others. And I like that idea. And you slowly get these, like, things that, like, you get a story. You get an arc of, like, here's uh, someone growing and improving. But a lot of it is, here's this. Tackle this. Which is very like a bit like Power Rangers, where it's like there is a arc, there is a growth, but here's an anime, and here's another one, and I like it because you, you don't have to deal with like, and then this one will come back in season two, which I know it does say season two. This is season one. Uh, season two hasn't been dubbed yet, so that might be a while. But I do find this series fun. And I think it's the, a free parlor of sorts near the end where it finishes that I absolutely love. And I think it's absolutely amazing.